Today we are showing the integration of Ledger as a Java card application into a YubiKey device. So um, the point of showing that is to provide an open source reference implementation of the Ledger wallet and also an implementation that can be licensed to everybody working with a Java card application. So, to show that it's very easy to work with the existing API, we are demonstrating it on Electrum. So I'm just plugging the device into the USB port and I am going to create a new wallet on Electrum, so exactly like I would create another wallet, call it Test Wallet Ubico, um, register it as a hardware wallet, as a BT chip wallet. Um, then I get a few APDUs here, I am prompt for my PIN code, so which is as always 1234. Um, Electrum is going to ask the device to diversify keys and then to fetch the addresses. After the addresses are fetched, they will appear, and from now, I am going to be able to perform transactions. So, uh, let's send some bitcoins. So, I'm choosing an address to pay here. Okay, coming back there, I will send uh, 1.8, and it's going to prepare the transaction, and here, since the YubiKey device is a USB and NFC device, the second factor can be a bit different. And we are leveraging on the fact that the key can emulate an NFC tag to just display the transaction on another, on another phone. So when you want to check the transaction, you will take the key, you will take your phone, your NFC phone, so here it's a Galaxy S6, but you don't have to take a Galaxy S6. Tap the tag on the phone, and read it as a regular poster. So here you get a summary of your transaction, so you can check the amount, the address, the change, and you have a pin code to type back on your original computer. Just going to do that. So we connect the key again, we push the button to activate it, and we type our unique pin code for this transaction. Then the key will sign the transaction, the transaction will be broadcasted, and exactly as if you were using a regular ledger application, the transaction is sent. So this code will be available as open source on GitHub and we will try to make it easy for people to get Java card objects, USB objects, YubiKeys or other objects that they can use so that they can play with this code and modify it.